Hole 10 at the Ledgestone Open, and Calvin Heimberg has the line, tosses it up. It's coming back down. It is Boom! Hole in one. Let's get on with the celebration. A little thumb to the middle of the hand over there, and then a little thumb hug on the other side over there. Not as clean as the throw, but you're excited. It's jubilation. High fives. Cleans up well. Woo! That was something you missed that you never planned on watching, and this is everything you missed that you never planned on watching. And today's episode is brought to you by Miracle Made. We're in the third game, Thailand versus Hungary in tech ball. Thailand's up 11 to eight. It's match point. One more and they win and they have the serve. It's over. Okay, Hungary, header over. And now we're gonna set up the big kick. Boom, except she misses. She hit the ledge. How did she miss? Well, she hit the plastic net. It never hit the table. He knew it the whole way. They get the serve back, and now it's 11-9. She's like, ugh, gets a massage, drinks out of her water, double-handed drink from him, wipes the mouth, wipes the forehead. He says, give me that towel. I want to wipe my forehead too. Makes our sweat a little bit. They get the ball. Okay, same play, another slam. This time her body went over the line, so that's another point. Now it's 11-10, and they're just going to run the same play. She says, calm down, give it to me. Kabam! Hits it so hard, it goes out of bounds. The coach celebrates. She celebrates. He's laying on the ground. She's like, okay, get up, get up, get up. And then watch this. He's like, I got up for the double high five. And she says, no, I'm praying and saying thank you. And he says, oh, oh, I'll mind your prayer. I'll pray too. And she says, double high five. And he says, well, I was in prayer because you were in prayer. And then that just got awkward at the end. But they did win. Little League World Series. Oh, I love the Little League World Series. We're in the regional tournaments. This is the Southwest. Winner of this goes to the regional championship. We got Oklahoma and Louisiana. And number 99, Jace Kent, hits an absolute bomb in the first inning. Two-run shot. Celebrates around second. Boom! Big splash. See his one teammate there? Big splash celebration. His one teammate doesn't fall down, number 30. Because he's, you know, that kid's going to want to be a lawyer when he grows up. He's checking home plate. Like, make sure you touch, dude. Make sure you touch. You know, I want it to count. Daps up the catcher. They have a special relationship. Now Oklahoma's up 7-3. Jace is on the mound. He walks that kid. I think he's going to hit the next kid. Yeah. And good sportsmanship. That brings in a run, but he goes, hey, man, I didn't mean it. These kids are better than you and better than me at being humans because they haven't been muddied up with nonsense yet. Louisiana, big comeback in the sixth inning. And a lot of people were using these highlights to show, oh, Oklahoma was showboating, and then what goes around comes around. But that's not really what happened at all. We do have a smart play here. Bases loaded, two outs, bunt to win the game. They let it go foul. Wow. What a ballsy call by the coach. Bunt to win the game. They let it go foul. The next pitch is high, three and two. But the catcher grabs it in time. They hold him at third. Next pitch, ball four, kid who walked. It was his birthday, so congrats to him. And watch the sportsmanship at the end of this. Well, first, he's got to knock over his buddy. Happy birthday, dude. Congrats on the walk. You're done. You're on the ground. And stay down. And stay down. Birthday punches for that kid for getting the walk. And then they all go up to number 99, and they give him hugs. And they're like, dude, that was awesome. Like, these kids come up to him. He must have been regarded as really good because – these shorter kids come up and they're like, yo, man, I just want to say hi. And then the coach of the opposing team comes up and I can't read his lips because it's sideways, but he definitely says something here like, hey, don't worry about what happened here. You're a hell of a ball player and I blah, blah, and you're, you're great and you did a great job. He says, thanks, coach. Thanks, coach. And that's the story of this game. Sumo, yes, this guy, he takes the rag, he wipes his arm and his armpit, and then he flips the rag to the other side. So, okay, this is more rag work in this episode wipes the sweat armpit he flips the rag over and uses the other side of the rag on the armpit and the arm and then straight to the face i don't know about all that and then a little mouth there too a little purse slips i don't know about all that while he's doing that his opponent is tossing salt and mean mugging all right let's do it now on the right side his weight's fully down. I don't know if this matters. On the left side, he's not fully down. He kind of just touches and then goes. Let's watch it, 
and then I'll slow it down because I love dissecting sumo matches of like what the strategy and what happened was. He wins. Easy. Oh, my God. Stares into our soul. So here's what happened. Mean salt throwing guy. He puts his right hand up to get himself some room and then goes for the belt. Now, he's got a firm grip on the belt with his right hand, and he's starting to grip the belt with his left hand, but that's a decoy. See, his left hand's going to the belt. All he wants to do is get that dude to worry about that left hand. So as soon as he sees that that guy is loosening his grip to slide his arm down to get that hand, he pulls it out because that was never the play, and now he's got him super off balance and tosses him. You can see from the other side, he uses his leg. He pulls him, and then look at his right leg. He gets it underneath, and once he has him off balance, boom, done. Quick work and mean. He's in battle mode, huh? Ugh. This episode of Things You Miss was brought to you by Miracle Made. Go to trymiracle.com slash missed to try Miracle Made sheets today. Order today and you can save over 40%. And if you use code MIST at checkout, you'll get three free towels and save an extra 20%. Your towels are old. Your sheets are old. You're probably a young dude in college or you just graduated college and you do not take care of yourself. They're helping you out right here. Try miracle.com slash mist and use code mist to claim your free three piece towel set and save over 40% off. Again, that's try miracle.com slash mist to treat yourself. Just a little programming note. A couple episodes ago on this show, we talked about the swimmer with no arms who set the record. That video has 10 million views on TikTok and like 15 million views across all social. So shout out to producer Rob Scirocco for finding that clip for me and delivering, because that is a crazy amount of views. Actually, a lot of these clips do really well on socials as solo clips, and I'm glad that you guys enjoy and watch the show here as well. Fan of the week, who do you got? Place your votes, place them with your heart. Subscribe to the channel if you enjoy it. Appreciate you guys. Have a great week.